Hello, welcome back to another Graphics 101 video, where we provide tips and tricks to get the best graphics and display on Windows. Today, we will talk through what specifications to consider when selecting an external monitor that meets your needs and works effortlessly with your PC. In this video, we will talk about four potential user groups and talk about the ideal display setup for each segment. The student slash home office worker, the designer slash content creator, the PC gamer, and the content enthusiast who likes to watch media on a larger screen. In each user segment, we will go through six different specs today and help you understand them. Resolution, screen size, aspect ratio, refresh rate, variable refresh rate, and high dynamic range. The recommendations for each spec are minimum recommendations. Note that this is a starting point for monitor recommendations and that there are several other details we do not go over in the video, such as price point, form factor, color gamut, etc. Understanding specs. Resolution is defined as the number of horizontal pixels times the number of vertical pixels. Higher resolution allows the display to show more visual content. Screen size is measured by the diagonal of the monitor in inches. How big you want your screen comes down to personal preference, the sharpness of your content, and the viewing distance. Aspect ratio is the ratio between the width and height of the screen. The most common aspect ratio for external monitors is 16 by 9. However, depending on the type of content you want to see, you may want a wider or taller display. Refresh rate is expressed in the unit hertz and refers to the number of times a display updates the image per second. It dictates how smooth animations, videos, and games look. 60 hertz is the most common monitor refresh rate. Higher refresh rates will increase animation smoothness. Variable refresh rate, VRR, allows the refresh rate of your monitor to continuously adjust from the GPU. For gamers, if a scene from your game results in a change in frame rate, VRR will adjust appropriately to prevent stuttering, input lag, and screen tearing. High dynamic range, HDR, delivers more color and brightness across a wider range. For gamers and content enthusiasts who are playing a game or watching a movie, HDR is a feature that can add additional realism and immersion to the experience. Keep in mind that not all HDR monitors have the same quality, and we recommend purchasing a monitor with a Display HDR 600 or Display HDR 500 True Black certification or above. Now that you know a little more about the different specifications, let's talk about some use cases. Student slash home office. This setup is ideal for someone who is on a budget and plans to run basic productivity apps such as Word, PowerPoint, or Edge. It includes an external monitor paired with a laptop or desktop PC. In this setup, the minimum external monitor resolution we recommend is 1080p. But in general, 1440p is recommended because the increased sharpness in text can help reduce eye strain. For the student slash home office worker, we recommend screen sizes between 24 inches and 27 inches. The most common aspect ratio is 16 by 9, and it will work nicely for the setup. But if you're looking to splurge a little, you may prefer a 21 by 9 ultra wide aspect ratio so that you have additional screen real estate. A 21 by 9 aspect ratio lets you have the space a dual monitor setup would allow while still only having one monitor. In Windows 11, ultra wide monitors have better window management possibilities. A refresh rate of 60 Hz is the most common monitor refresh rate and works best for this audience. Designer slash content creator. This setup is ideal for those that require multiple higher end monitors for their workflow. In this setup, the minimum resolution we recommend you consider is 1440p, but we really recommend at least 4K to produce quality content. In this case, if you have a 4K monitor, we recommend a monitor of at least 27 inches to really see the sharpness. For the aspect ratio, multiple 16 by nine monitors or a 21 by nine aspect ratio can increase productivity if you're looking for additional screen real estate. But one 16 by nine monitor should also serve well in most cases. 60 Hertz is a suitable refresh rate for this audience. For those that work with images or videos, we also recommend an HDR display. PC Gamer. This setup is ideal for someone who prioritizes smooth frame rates and ultra realistic visuals. It usually consists of a powerful desktop or laptop connected to one or more external monitors. In this setup, we recommend a range between 1080p and 4K resolution. 
The trade-off between a lower resolution is a higher performance and frame rate, so if you don't have a premium GPU and want a higher frame rate, a lower resolution might be preferred over a higher resolution. Like the developer slash content creator, we recommend a monitor of at least 27 inches for good immersive experience while gaming. Most games have a 16 by 9 aspect ratio, so if you plan on using an ultra-wide monitor, be sure to check if your game supports this ratio. Some gamers may want an ultra-wide monitor for increased field of view in their games, but not all games support this aspect ratio. For this audience, we recommend refresh rates of 120Hz or higher as they can result in smoother game movement and faster reaction times. To make the most of your gaming experience, we also recommend a setup that supports VRR and HDR. Be sure that the HDR certification is Display HDR 600 or Display HDR 500 True Black or higher. Content Enthusiast This setup is ideal for someone who would like to project their PC onto a larger screen, such as a TV. For viewing screens at a further viewing distance, the screen size can go up to 65 inches. For screen resolution, we recommend at least 4K resolution for a more immersive, clear viewing experience that matches the resolution of most digital video content. The most common ratio for digital videos is 16 by 9. For this audience, we recommend 60 Hz. We also recommend that the screen supports HDR. I hope this video helped you understand a little more about the different specifications that can influence your display setup and which spec would be most suitable for you. If you want to learn more about some of the specs and features that we talked about in the video, we have included some links for you to learn more in the description. Let us know what other features you would like to learn more about.